Next thing you know, all I remember is headlights and asphalt. This 14-year-old hit by a driver in a Portland crosswalk, and tonight the search is on for the woman who took off, leaving her in the middle of the road. And we're digging deeper into efforts that could make this street safer. Welcome, everyone, to Coin 6 News at 11. I'm Jeff Gianola. Kelly is off tonight. And that hit and run happened at 1 this afternoon on Powell and 26. It's right in the middle of what's considered a high crash corridor. Jolie Winaga found out there are plans in the works to improve safety in the area. He's live tonight in Southeast Portland with the latest. Joel? Good evening, Jeff. This was actually the second hit and run since January in this general area. As you mentioned, the latest hit and run just this afternoon when that 14 year old girl tried to cross this busy street in a marked crosswalk when she was struck by that hit and run driver. She was left for dead in the middle of the road. Just outside the OHSU emergency room, 14 year old Victoria Courtney is discharged hours after being hit by a hit and run driver. I could have been seriously hurt and she would have never known. I could have been there forever just laying there because she didn't stop. Police tell me Victoria was crossing busy Powell Boulevard at 26th Avenue around 1 o'clock Monday afternoon. She and a friend were in the marked crosswalk when officers say a woman driving an SUV, possibly a gold Lexus, pulled into the intersection and struck the teenager. I'm sorry she has to have that on her conscience now, and I'm sorry that she has to live with the fact that she hit a person and didn't stop. Officers tell me the driver in her 40s then sped off, last seen headed westbound on Powell toward downtown, leaving Victoria lying in the road with a broken foot and possibly other internal injuries. I'm very angry. You know, as a driver, you have responsibilities, especially if you hit something or someone, you have to stop. First of all, she didn't know if she was okay, she didn't know if she killed her. ODOT tells me there is new funding for safety improvements in the area of Southeast Powell between 26th and 33rd Avenues, but we've learned it's not in the budget until 2016. What else could the city do to make this a better, a safer intersection? I think um, rather than what could the city do is maybe more driver education. Victoria still can't believe someone left her for dead in the middle of the road. Could I have died? Could I have been more seriously injured? And I think that's why she ran. And because this did happen right in the middle of the day, police officers are hoping someone saw something, perhaps that gold Lexus heading westbound towards downtown on Powell. Perhaps someone got a license plate. Reporting live here in Southeast Portland, Joel Lee Winaga, Coin 6 News. Jeff?